one, bang, broadcast January 4th in the year of our Lord 2014, or actually resume cast, already casted earlier this morning, and uh, now I shall finish off the rest of my Walking Dead games, we've done all of episode, or season one, and the 400 days, and uh, now this is season two, so this was just released a little while ago. Um, so this is relatively new. This is pfft, playing something new, Tabarnak. And uh, I got it on the Steam sale. I think I got it for like, uh, I forget what I paid. 15 bucks? I don't know, it was like 30% off or something. I don't know, it was reasonable. And uh, I want to be on the ball with this game when they keep releasing episodic content. So when they do release it, I can broadcast it. Bang. Um, something that's new, um, it's intriguing. So uh, let's see when I, when I left when we last left the game. Clementine, uh, Lee is dead. Lee, he fought the good fight. He tried, but he did not make it to the end with Clementine. And uh, I told Clementine to go with what well, Omid and that other chick, the couple. I told the couple to go look for the boat, but even though there was this one conversation where I agreed that they should, we should not go for the boat, we should try to just walk through the countryside. So I told Clementine, as Lee is dying, you tell Clementine, you got to find the couple, um, you're going to find the boat or something. Um, I, I would like to have changed that, but hey, the decision's made. It's set in course. Um, but at the end of episode, the last season here, we see Clementine walking through this field and uh, she's walking and then all of a sudden she sees this hill and there's these two people walking and you can't really tell if they're walkers or not they're just kind of moving and then all of a sudden they stop and they turn and they see Clementine so uh, and that's how it ends just and then it goes boom you know classic Walking Dead style always fucking make you wait and leave you in a suspense um, so this will be really cool We'll pick up with Clementine, and we'll see what happens with her. So since I already did this day in history, there's only one thing to do, and that's to start the show. And I start with a song by Queens of the Stone Age, Spiders and Vinegroons, off of their self-titled album, Reissue Edition. Start the show.
we go. Awesome. That that sets the tone. That sets the tone right there. The tone in my bone. Here I gotta shrink the chat. And as I shrink the chat the shrink the chat and shrink the chat. <laughs> I say hello, good evening, Mega Man. Good to see you, brother. Duncan Hines, the cake, brother, friend, welcome. Tactical Hound is here. Hello. <laughs> good evening. Well, it's good to see that there's more than one person in the in the in the chat this this time. <laughs> Have a bit more company. You know, sometimes a Kubrick gets lonely sitting in his jet, sitting in the cast. So, here we go. Rockin' Season 2, baby. So, there'll probably be. And Loco! Hey, Loco! What's up, essay? I wrote my essay. Hello, essay. Thanks for writing the essay. Thanks for joining the Geist Mine. <laughs> mm. I love my early morning cast. Nothing like a fucking. The end of the first one, Duncan. You know what? It was powerful, brother. It was powerful. It's. It kind of feels like. We elaborated. I elaborated a bit on this idea of the the last cast, but the, the idea of protecting the little girl, kind of like in The Last of Us and uh, uh, Bioshock, you know, taking on the role of the protector, the guardian, especially such a young kid, and then, you know, Lee, he tries so hard, and uh, by the end of it, I had a fucking chopped off arm. <laughs> It was uh, it was pretty good. It was pretty good. Uh, uh, I was very impressed. I think this is fucking awesome video game making right here. That's my opinion. So we have all the this is the new season. We only have chapter one, episode one. It's called All That Remains Here. Then we see the ones later on a house divided now I believe this is the Chinese guy or the Asian guy that I saw in the bus from 400 days um, so house divided chapter 2 uh, in harm's way amid the ruins now this one looks creepy oh look at that one she's got blood on her face and shit and then no going back. So this will unfold slowly, but surely. I think it's a cool thing to cast because every everybody has a different uh, everybody has a different uh, way of play, so you get a different story. So here we go. All that remains. Import season one save. Season two of The Walking Dead builds off season one's choices and consequences. The game will now automatically search your system for a season one save file with completed episodes. Oh, ho. cool. A season one save file was found. You will now need to choose a save slot from season one to continue. Your story choices will be randomly generated for any unfinished episodes. Awesome. So it's going to take everything. See, I, I like this concept that everything that you build from the very first season is going to follow all the way to the end as long as they keep making this game. That's brilliant. That's fucking awesome. What can you say? Previously on The Walking Dead. Oh, Mead and the the couple, they're alive, I think. But Kenny got killed. All by yourself through this? Ben got killed. I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. This is 
not how the world works now. Lee, are those bad people dead? I hope you know what you're doing with her. I got it! Molly said Crawford is the only place left in Savannah that still has people. That means it must be where my mom and dad are. Okay. You can come. But you have to promise to stay quiet. <laughs> Clementine? Clementine! <laughs> oh. Oh. No. Going for that you know, fucking dad. She wouldn't be exposed to what she has been with you. Die! Oh yeah, Clementine had to shoot that guy. Lee, I saw my parents. Come here, sweet pea. You have to shoot me, honey. Lee, no. That don't meet and Krista. Oh, meet and Krista. Thank you. That whole scene was a fucking tense scene. You're sitting in the chair, and he's just asking you questions. Season two, baby. <laughs> Go with Christ, bro. So now Clementine's out there on her own. I was getting verklempt. Verklempt, the 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 stage before think? teary eyed. I was getting choked. For sure. Oh man, you can't be serious. I am. We are not doing that. Why not? Because. Come on, Krista. What's wrong with Omid? We're not calling our baby Omid. One of you is enough. Oh fuck, she's pregnant. Clementine, oh. a little help here. Fuck a pregnant woman. Omid the second. No. Oh, they changed the thing. Omid Jr. No. You have to admit it has a ring to it. Omid is a good name. I oh, like I don't it. like. I don't like Thank how they changed that. You always agree with him. Because I'm always right. You're not taking this seriously. I take everything seriously, especially the Lomit's future. I can't believe they chose Keep that talking, menu. And you'll be sleeping in the rain tonight. Over the old one. I think the old one Remember is less intrusive cars, on the screen. Vegas weekend. Now you have this big blocky thing. What's that? Why I think that's a you, poor uh, choice. Uh, get cleaned up in the girls' room, Clem. I hope the sink works in there. I wouldn't count on it. Just be careful and make sure to keep track of your things. We'll be right next door. Okay. So my plan is Clementine this time, I guess. I hope I taught her well. Taught her how to fire. Keep Hello? her hair short. Be able to look under the stalls like you would do in real life. Ugh, what's that? <laughs> Glory hole. <laughs> yeah, why are they sending her in there? Well, I guess she's packing heat. Well, Clementine's not your regular kid. She knows how to fucking take care. Good. No one's here. Guess it's safe to get cleaned up. Is it safe? <laughs> Zombie glory. <laughs> uh. Figures. 
Oh, she put the gun down. Grab that fucking gun first, Clementine. Tabarnak. <laughs> Something's gonna happen. I don't like this. Oh jeez, my nerves. Zombie gonna come out of the toilet or something? Okay, good. No toilet Ew. zombies. Wait, who the fuck is that? I see you. Get out of there. You're not fooling me. Who are you? None of your business. Are you gonna hurt me? Only if you're stupid. Don't be stupid, stupid. Get out here. Oh, crazy black bitch. <laughs> you got anything on you? Come on, let's see. No, that's all I have. That's it? How'd you make it this long? I'm serious, what else you got? That's it. Don't Wait, lie to me. You gonna shoot a girl? Give me what you got. I'm not screwing around, come on. Just walk away. Whatever. Give me that hat. No! No fucking way. Where'd you get it? I asked you a question. My dad gave it to me. Just give it to me. You heartless bitch. Give me your hat, bitch. Junk, junk, junk. Look at all this junk. Shit, shit, and more shit. Why you ain't got nothing good? Not like the last people I got. They had all kinds of good shit. That was a good catch. You ain't got nothing good. You're just a little fish. You gonna cry, little fish? Come on, Omid, you better fucking- This your daddy? What a bozo. Ah, <gasps> uh, just like that. You fucking bitch. The Quifa. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to. Oh. Tell that Mac. Oh God. Oh me. Oh me. Oh me. Can you hear me? Oh me. <laughs> Just like that. <laughs> wow, Omi did not get any more camera time. He is done. Boom. Good start. Powerful. 16 months later. Holy fuck, more than a year later. 
Ooh, look at Clementine. I think she's in the mode, man. Kill mode. So now she's ten years old. Krista, talk to me. <laughs> Where's the baby? Oh, fuck. She's got no baby. <sighs> This will never work. Look at this. It's pathetic. The wood's too wet to burn. Coral. More smoke than flame. At this rate, we'll be eating this for breakfast. What else can we do? Find something that'll burn, maybe. I don't know. Won't be easy in the dark and in the rain. You should be doing this, not me. Tending a fire so you can <laughs> cook and stay warm. It's something you have to be able to do, Clementine. Otherwise... We can't build a big fire at night. It attracts too much attention. It's too dangerous when we're out here by ourselves. We need to eat, don't we? We can't survive without food. I'm freezing. You think this is bad? Wait till we get up to Wellington. Then talk to me about cold. If we make it. We still have a couple hard months ahead of us. This rain will turn to sleet. Then ice. Then snow. It won't be easy. Is it safe there? Safer than here because of the cold. Or so they say. We just need to keep moving north. Yeah, just light the whole fucking thing on fire. <laughs> I miss Lee. I'm sure you do. Now I'm gonna go look for more wood. You just keep the fire lit. Kenny, his boy, his wife. Oh, the memories. There's the lighter. Press and hold the left button to flick them, then push the mouth. Cooking that it's better, but still not enough. A rabbit the flames are too low. Or some I don't know. It's like a dog almost. What is that? This will never cook. <sighs> this won't burn. This might burn. <laughs> Controls do. <laughs> it's a little much.
flames aren't high enough. Make the flames burn higher. Wait, what happened there? Did I put the log? It's an omen. Hide. I'm not gonna burn the floor. Where's the rest of your group? I, I'm by myself. Bullshit. She's lying. Cut the shit, lady. It's it's just me. Come on, guys. What the Krista, fuck? Run! Hey. Oh boy. Get the fuck over here! Now! Fucker. Come out here, girl. I'm not fucking around. Shit! Fuck! Fuck! Over here! Oh, they have quick time events now. Oh, shit! <laughs> Fuck away from me, you fucker. Oh, whoa. Yeah! Are you fucking kidding me? Go, oh, Clementine. Leave me alone! You're fucking running! It's storming! Oh, she put his thumb off the bar Come out of there. Little fucker. Jesus, are you fucking kidding me? That escalated very quickly. That got wow. That got out of control really, really quickly. <laughs> That's this game in the fucking nutshell. Everything's calm, then all of a sudden, fucking couple people dead. You're lost. <laughs> Good start. Hello?
<clears throat> Strong kid. I taught her good. Krista, are you there? Hey, Helsel. Welcome, brother. Good evening. Sit down, relax. Ooh, somebody was here. PS4, swanky. Bears, snakes, coyotes. being hunted here. I have a feeling like I'm being hunted. There's blood on that log. Goes there. Ah! Tabarnak! Fuck you! Crows is another almond. <gasps> What's that? Oh fuck, it's a wolf? No, maybe just a dog. It's a doggy! A doggy! It's Sammy. Oh, it's not friendly, doggy. It's okay, boy. It's okay. Oh, shh, shh. Be quiet, doggy. Sam. Well, nice to meet you, Sam. Oh, he's a pooper. He's probably going to get killed right away, what so I'm not going to get doing? attached. shelter. Hello? Looks pretty run over, but you never know. Let's look around for some food. Sammy! Sammy Davis Jr. What's going on here? I have the thing. Oh. It looks like you've been here for a while. It looks like they were a happy family once. I hope they left some food behind somewhere.
toys. Hmm, nothing edible. Eat the doll. <sighs> Empty. Better keep looking, huh, Sam? It's not much of a tent anymore. I bet scavengers tore it apart. That thing got ripped to shit, bruh. Think anyone's been sleeping in here? I can't tell. Maybe we'd better not wait around to find out. Check under the van? Gurgle, gurgle, gurgle. It's nothing. A flying disc. A flying novelty disc. A novelty flying disc. Hey, wanna play? Wanna play catch? <laughs> okay, oh, okay. Bring it back. <laughs> I'd use everything as a weapon. That barbecue, that Good little boy, hibachi. Sam. Use that. I'd use a paint can. Let's do one more. Wanna go again? Go get it, Sam. Go get it, Sammy. Yeah, I'm getting too attached to the dog. It's gonna die. I sure do. Okay, that's enough. I'm gonna throw the disc and it's gonna get killed. <laughs> Let's just keep moving. Okay, I guess I have no choice. Let's go one more time. Go get it, boy. Don't throw it too far. Oh, of course, you did. Darn. It was good while it lasted, though, right? Yeah, you're right. Shouldn't waste the energy anyway. Sam? Shh. We have to be quiet. Keep it down, boy. Oh, there's a walker right there. Uh. No food here, either. The bite. Oh. Looks like he tried to cut it out. That fucker's moving. But that never works. Ever. <laughs> it's okay. We're smart. He's not. We're smarter than all of them. It's okay, boy. Shh. Yeah, shh. He can't hurt us. Think he had himself tied up? Or did someone force him to do this? That looks like it hurt. Watch it. Okay, that ain't no good. Here we go. Stand back, okay? Time to bash some skulls in. Yeah, yeah baby. 
One more for good measure. Phony and you beautiful bastard. Welcome. Good evening. What's what's the word? There we go. Just caving in some skulls. You know how I do. See, we just have to stay out of their reach. We found something useful. We won't go another night without food, okay? Wait, search the pocket. Let's not get carried away here. Ah, uh, so you only get to pick one thing from that scent? Ugh. Come on. Please let there be something good in there. on the grill, nothing in the cooler. Ugh, I hate scavengers. They take everything. <laughs> That's what she's doing, scavenger. It's the way she goes. Wonder what was in his pocket. I bet it was something for food. Died. Oh my god. Thank you. Look, Sam. A can. Let's see what's inside. Oh yeah, can opener. Very valuable in the zombie apocalypse as well. So you're not stabbing it open. Please don't be bad. fruit. The more you eat, the more you toot. I guess you are pretty hungry too. Here you go, pooch. Here you go. Hey, you don't eat it all. Holy fuck, you stupid dog! Double luck! Fucking kill you, dog! Yeah. Holy shit, man. We ain't friends no more. Sammy, you piece of shit. I gave you my beans, bruh. Sammy. And more likely, it's gonna be you than me. Hi. Whew. I need some fucking 
medical aid. Dog bite, tabarnak. Fucking Clementine, not doing so well. Clementine. I think we're safe. Yeah, yeah, we're good. Hey, you all right? I, I think so. What are you doing out here? Where are the, uh, the people you're with? There's no chance you made it this long on your own. I don't want them thinking we're doing anything but trying to help you. I'm alone. Everyone I know is gone. It's just me now. I'm sorry to hear that. I just lost a sister. We've all lost folks. Well... I'm Luke. And this is Pete. Hey there. Luke Hi. and Pete. I'm Clementine. And it's nice to meet you, Clementine. But for now, we're gonna take you back to our group. Okay, we got a doctor with us, and you look like you could use some- Oh, shit! <laughs> what? What is it? She- It's not a- bit, man. Fuck. It's a dog fight. Fuck, fuck, fuck. What are we gonna do here? No, it was a dog. I didn't see any dog, Clementine. I killed the dog. Come on, kid. We just saw you with those lurkers back there. No, it really was a dog. Please, believe me. Look, I want to, kid. But I gotta believe my own two eyes first, and I didn't see no dog around. No, it was from before. Hmm, all right. Let's see. Whoa, 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 hey, watch yourself. 
Hey, don't look at me like that. You're the one that's bit here, okay? See? Is it, uh, is it like she says? Well, it could be a dog. Hard to say. So where'd this dog go? The one that did this. Now what... What does that matter, Pete? Seriously. I... I killed it. What? Really? A dog shows up and bites you and you just kill it? What would you uh, have done? Uh, yeah? I don't know. It attacked me. Still, you don't... You don't kill dogs. You don't kill dogs. <laughs> What are you, Clementine? fucking FEMA, fucking SPCA? Yes. You telling us the truth? FEMA? You look me in the eyes when you answer. Yes. All right, Clementine. That's good enough for me. Well, what else was she gonna say? I've got a good bullshit detector, Luke. That's why you can never beat me at poker. <laughs> you don't always beat me at... <laughs> All right, how can you be sure? Well, I'm sure I ain't willing to leave a little girl in the woods to die when we got a doctor with us that can make a call. We can have Carlos take a look at it first. <laughs> Sarah McLaughlin, and then she'll have that sad commercial. Ain't gonna like this. PETA, PETA, that's it. FEMA. You. I don't know my acronyms. Right. <laughs> Sorry, sir. FEMA, PETA, same shit. FEMA, PETA, lead a ding on. dong. I don't give a fuck. Use your full name, not talking in acronyms. Clementine, are you feeling all right? I'm fine. Just tired. Well, you better be fine. Because I ain't carrying you anymore with that bite on your arm. Don't worry about... Oh, shit. Clementine goes hard. Peter Peter. <laughs> what? And you just believed her? You should have put her out of her misery right there. Dog bite my ass. I need a dog. Whoa! <gasps> Fucker. Keep your finger off the trigger, boy. Whoa! Whoa! What the fuck? You idiot! Every lurker for five miles probably hurt. You're the that. one telling me to fucking shoot her. Everybody just calm down for a second. Clementine, you okay? I just need a doctor, and then, and then I'll go. I don't want my arm to get infected. None of us want to get infected. That's the point. We got a doctor right here, okay? He'll have a look. Now what the hell is wrong with you people? Okay, she's just scared. We're all scared, Luke. Don't act like we're the ones being irrational because we don't buy this bullshit story. No way she survived out here on her own. Why are we even arguing about this? Let me take a look. It's okay. Go ahead. He's a doctor. Damn, that must have hurt. Lee didn't make it, Oil. Good evening. He didn't... He didn't make it, bro. Hmm. Whatever it was, it got you good. This isn't how we do things, man. When you're bit, you get put down. End of story. I'm not going through this again. No one suggesting that. We could take her arm off. <gasps> Holy fuck. I know fuck. that worked for a cousin down in Ainsworth. We could try that. That doesn't work. I've seen it. It won't do any good. You'll just be making it worse for the girl. It's crazy. No one's going to volunteer to do that. I would. If it beat saving her life. Then what? How would we know it worked? Just let... I just want to fix my arm to stop the bleeding. I'm not going to hurt anyone. I promise you, it was just a dog bite. That's all it was. We'll know soon enough, young lady. Who's she? Sarah, what I say, stay inside. I don't mean to be any trouble. I just want to stop the bleeding and then I'll go. You'll never see me again, I promise. And where exactly would you go? To find my friend Krista. Forget it. You won't get five feet. I understand. 
understand you're scared. And I feel terrible delaying treatment. We've got to be sure. So, what do you think? Was it a lurker? A bite like that could be anything. Only one way to find out. How? We wait. What? By tomorrow morning, if the fever set in, we'll know if she's gonna turn. In the meantime, we can lock her in the shed. What about my arm? It needs to get cleaned and, and stitched and bandaged. The girl is in bad shape, Carlos. And we have all that stuff inside the cabin. We could probably get by Alvin, with it. Alvin, please. But, yeah, we can't do nothing. I'm not wasting supplies on a lurker bite. If it turns out you're telling the truth, I'll clean it and stitch it up for you in the morning. But... It's no That's good, awesome. man. It's the best we're gonna get. Finger off the trigger, son. I ain't your son. Don't be like that, man. It's all right. Boy's got his mom's temper. Come on. You're not my dad, man. Not my dad. It's just a waste of time. You'll see. And when she turns, I ain't gonna be the one cleaning up the ship. <sighs> it was a dog. You'll see. I guess we'll find out in the morning. If I last that long, maybe you could go look for it? I wish I could. I really do, but it's too risky. I'm sorry. Fuck, maybe I should have said something else there. See hammer, hammer time. No, look. Okay. Oh, come on, Clementine. I guess she's really hurt. Not much left in here. I guess if I have to, I can use this for stitches. Sure is pointy. That's not working. How about Mac? It's always something. Nobody builds anything right in this game. Like, everything breaks constantly. Alright. Hammer time. No, use the thing to unclaw. Go 
Good girl. I could be a character. <laughs> I could see me being a doctor. He's gotta have I get killed really stitches. quick. Actually, look at that roof they have right there. It's got a skylight in it. See, you can see a skylight. Three tab shingles. Here we go. Pull that fucking plan. Use the hand. Metal Gear Solid on their ass. House meeting in five minutes. Best. Best. It won't take long. There's a few things we need to discuss. Fine. Oh no, I broke my knife. That was dumb. Talk about that. Well, I got it open. You made my well, Luke has more to say, I guess. Where's Sarah? She's got her book. She doesn't need to be a part of it. Look at Clementine, little ninja. I wonder where they keep the supplies. It's a duck. I remember duck. Duck. <laughs> There's nothing in here, Tabanak, no, nothing. Okay. Back outside. This is pretty cool.
flash off the cut, maybe? Clean. Oh, I thought I was gonna do all Still need some bandages okay. and something to keep it from getting infected. Okay. They have to have medical supplies around here somewhere. Damn it. Just need to have this baby. <laughs> Let it be okay, and let it be his. Let it be his? Oh, oh. Help me. I'm not supposed to talk to you. My dad can't know. Help me, and I won't tell him. I... I'm hurt. Please help me. I, well, I shouldn't. What happened to you? A dog bit me. Sounds scary. I bet it hurt. You want to see it? Uh, it really wasn't one of them. It really wasn't. Okay. Ew, gross. I know, right? You have to bandage it, like my dad does. Yeah, I know. Help me. I need something to clean it up, and something to wrap it with. A clean bandage. My dad says we're out of real bandages. But I know where to get something to clean it. That's what this applies. I'll help you. Good. Thank you. I'm Sarah. I'm Clementine. We're friends. Right? We can be best friends. I haven't met another girl my age since way before. It's hard to be the only girl, you know? Rebecca is okay, but she's old. And that's it. Yes, we are friends. Promise? It's important. Friends have to trust each other, no matter what. Okay, I promise. It. I promise. Me too. Friends. Oh, pinky, pinky swear. A pinky swear is forever. I'll see if I can find the stuff my dad uses when I get a gun. Let me look around. <laughs> Talk about <f> <laughs> Yeah. That's what they do. <laughs> I think this is it. That'll awesome. work. You can't do it here though. Someone will find you. Don't worry. I won't. Thanks, Sarah. So should I go to the bathroom and clean it up? Oh, I still need bandages. Fridge door. <laughs> I 
<laughs> Jeez. Okay, I'll be right back. I take a pee pee. <laughs> you know what, Megan? That's good. I didn't even think about the uh, rabies. Fuck. <laughs> That's a good point. Rabies will kill you, too. Looking for bandages, I need a bandage of my arm. Maybe I could just use some clothes or something. Or something or other. A watch? No, no, no. Let's just keep that. I don't need no stinking watch. There we go, right? Not exactly bandages, but they should help stop the bleeding. Yeah, yeah, they will. So now back to the shed. Wait, let me just check a little more. Oh. All right, let's get the fuck out. Yes, there. Hydrogen peroxide. When you pour it on your wounds, it makes your blood all fizzy. And it hurts like a fuck. But you know it does the job. This is gonna suck. <laughs> fuck yeah, it is. So let's clean it off.
Yeah, hey, see, it does that. <laughs> it's nice and busy. Okay. Okay, I'm good. I'm fine. And now the fun part. Oh, yeah, this should be good. Stitching yourself out, that'd be so fucking tough. Maybe on the top of the arm, that wouldn't be so bad. It'd still be very painful, but... Now, just like last time, just how Crystal showed me. Damn, Clementine, you're crazy. Top of neck. Fuck. How many times do I gotta do this? Fuck off. It's just painful to watch. <laughs> For a ten-year-old, that's fucking tough as balls, man. <laughs> I wasn't doing that. It did. I... <sighs> Fuck, how long is this gonna go on? How many more? Just one more, hopefully. So brutal. <laughs> Another one? Oh, fuck off. Just end this. Who thought of this? This is crazy. Good job, Clementine. Banish that shit out. She don't need no stinking doctor. Almost killed me right there. What am I looking for, Tabanak? The brick. Holy shit. Now they see how fucking tough she is. <laughs> now they're like, holy fuck. The girl's tough as nails. Are you alright? I'm still not bitten. Nice. <laughs> awesome. I never was. And you left me out here to die. You patched yourself up? Where'd you get that stuff? Did she steal from us? This doesn't change a thing. She hasn't done anything to us. Says the man not carrying a babe. I did. I took stuff. And I'm sorry. I really am. And you think you can trust her? 
God damn it, don't even start. Any of you would have done the same if you were half as tough as this little girl. So just save it. Bring her in, and I'll take a look at her arm. Damn lurker sneaking around out here. We better get inside. You hungry? She's the Neo of the zombie apocalypse. That's right, she's the chosen one. <laughs> This might hurt a little. Ow. How she look? Her suturing skills need some work, but otherwise, I say she should be fine. So, it wasn't a lurker bite? <laughs> if it was, the fever would have already set in, and the temperature Pray would be through the roof. Clementine. I wish you wouldn't have done what you did. What do you mean? You manipulated my daughter. I asked for her help. She's not someone you can just ask for help. I'll give you the benefit of the doubt, but there are a few things you need to know about my daughter. Okay. She isn't like you. You may not get that initially, but once you're around her for a while, You'll understand. If she knew how bad the world is, what is really like out there, she would cease to function. What? She's my little girl. She's all I have left. And I would ask that you stay away from her. I'm sorry. I didn't know. It's okay. You're forgiven. Just don't make any more mistakes. Trying to stay on that guy's good side. It's always good to know a doctor in the zombie apocalypse. Hey, uh, brought you some food if you're hungry. Fuck yeah, yeah. That fucking dog trying to eat my beans. That's gonna leave one hell of a scar. Better than losing it. Now you can say that again. Scars? They're way cooler than stumps. What? Nothing. I just had a friend who lost his arm once. That's all. Sensitive issue. Way to put your foot in your mouth, dumbass. Hey, look. I just want to say I'm sorry for... for being a dick out there. <laughs> I got kind of aggro, and that Dog was definitely beep. not cool. Nick's been known to go off every once in a while. Don't hold it against him. Yeah, I guess we all have our moments. You definitely had one out there. You were just protecting your friends. I get it. Well, I didn't mean to be so harsh. I just... Uh, we had a bad experience once. We've all had bad experiences. Nick lost his mom. We took care of someone who got bit. It was my fault. I... It was no one's fault. We thought we could control it, but we couldn't. And then she turned, and his mom was standing right there, and she got attacked. And there was nothing we could do about it. Anyway, hopefully you understand. I do. Yeah. What is she eating exactly? What is that? Some... So, since you're pretty much on your own, what's your plan? I'm thinking about moving on. Well, you're welcome to stay here if you want. You let yourself heal up. Take some time to sort things out. Do you think everyone else will be okay with it? They'll just have to deal with it. So... 
What happened to your parents? If you don't mind me asking. I mean, I assume what happened to them is what happened to just about everyone's parents. You're just so young. Didn't think you could have made it on your own for so long, but maybe you did. Other people took care of me, if that's what you're asking. I was just curious on how you made it this far. I just tried to stay with good people and not do anything dumb. Hey, I'm sorry. I I shouldn't have asked. Really nice scene here. The table, the table, the candle. My parents went on vacation and left me with a babysitter. And they never came back. We went to Savannah to find them, but they were already dead. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. This man Her parents are dead. She saw me and took care of She me. saw them in the streets in Savannah. We met up with other survivors, and we all tried to make it, but it didn't work. His name was Lee. He taught me how to survive. Good old Lee. He's the reason I keep my hair short. What uh, happened to him? The same thing that happens to everyone. But he saved me first. Lots of times. Well, sounds like he was a real good guy. Yeah. He was. I hate to interrupt, but I'm out there standing watch and I can't help but notice this place is lit up like a goddamn beacon in the middle of the woods. Yeah, it's time to turn in anyways. Now get your winks while you can, because we're going fishing at first light. Couple fresh brookies for dinner? Hmm, wouldn't that be nice? I guess it'd be good to know how to fish, too. You're still here. I've been fishing a couple times. I've been ice fishing, and this is not, I've never caught a fish in my life. Tabarnak. I've gone maybe half a dozen times. No. I wouldn't get comfortable if I were you. Luke invited me to stay. Good for him. But that's not how things work around here. We make decisions as a group, and you're wearing out your welcome. You got what you came here for. Now go. I could have called her out on the baby thing, but I chose not to, because I'm above that. Clementine is a good person. I want her to stay intact during this episode. <laughs> Fuck, this one time I went ice fishing. Uh, How you holding up? I heard you got an earful from Rebecca last Everybody night. Everybody caught a fish except me. Once she gets going, there's no bringing her back. Her bark's worse than her... What's her problem? Yeah, well, she's got a lot on her mind lately. Bringing a baby into a world like this. She does sound like Michonne. How the... far are these fish traps? It ain't much further. The black chick. The knocked up black chick. Anyone teach you how to shoot? Mm -hmm. By that I mean taught proper. Any idiot with a finger can shoot. Yeah, but not a rifle. Well, that makes sense. Less kick. This thing would probably knock you on your ass. Nick was about your age, first time I took him hunting. Came across this beautiful 13-point buck just standing there on the ridge line. The boy takes the rifle, he lines up the shot just like I taught him, and then I hear him start whining. He turns to me and he says, I can't do it. I can't shoot it, Uncle Pete. Please don't make me shoot it. Oh, that's sad. Hey, why didn't you wait? You want us standing around while you piss on a tree? You know where the river is, boy. Anyway, so I grab the gun out of his hand before the big buck runs off, when bang, the gun fires. Boy nearly gut shot me. And of course, the buck gets away. What are you going and telling her this shit for? Because you almost blew her face off yesterday. Seems <laughs> relevant. Trying to let her know it's nothing personal with you. 
Why are you always giving me a hard time? Because you're always giving everyone else a hard time. I apologized already. She accepted. Okay, well I didn't know that. It's fine. He apologized. You're always trying to embarrass me. You're doing a good enough job of that on your own. Styles, my brother from another mother. Leaving us again. I know where the fucking river is. Fuck yeah, I love this shit. I think this is awesome. <laughs> kind of, uh... Storytelling, so anyway, game I found incorporated. That buck later that it, season. It's great. Shot it right in the neck. I brought it up to my sisters, figuring she'd want to freeze some of the meat. Nick didn't speak to me for weeks. Sometimes you gotta play a role. Even if it means people you love hate <laughs> you for it. You should tell him that. Yes. Uncle Pete! Nick! And even this, even though you see this gameplay here, Styles, the way that you play it will be completely different. That's what I really love, is that they figured out a way to make it very unique for everybody's play. Ah, uh, full of holes. Who do you think did this? Not sure yet, but it ain't your average gang of thugs, that much I know. Think about it. Your Carver, what do you do? Who's Carver? Check those guys there. Be careful. Some of them might still be moving. What can I do? See if you can find anything else. Like what? Like what might tell us who did this. That jacket, I swear I've seen that jacket. Oh, that looks like what? This what's... one's shot too. Um, Through the head? Roman? Yeah. I think that might be Roman. Check the rest. And look for ammo. We're running low. I think. From the 400 days and the group uh, back at Savannah. Or maybe I'm crazy. Can I help? I got it. more out there. This wasn't no rinky-dink pissing match. What was it then? Fubar. Fubar. Where are you going? We need to get the fuck out of here. Gotta check the rest. What? Why? Calm down and think about it, son. Calm down? We gotta get out of here now. What if someone's alive, Nick? Who cares? Because they might just be inclined to tell us who did this. We gotta do this now. Stay here. Keep searching these. This is a dumb idea. You know, Nick, I don't like this either. But sooner or later, you're gonna have to realize a simple truth. What, that you're an asshole? That nobody in this world is ever gonna give a goddamn whether you like something or not. You gotta grow up, son. Whatever. Whatever. Come on, Clint. You're not my you dad! Be useful? Keep a lookout on that tree line. Whoever did this might still be out there, waiting for another <sighs> sucker to stumble across this mess. Just like baiting a fish. I'd be more useful with a gun. I don't doubt it. At some point, you guys have to trust me. Hell, I trust you. But not everyone's at that point yet. Give them time. Look, just Ooh, keep your head on straight. <laughs> Same deal. All shot to pieces. Hope this isn't anyone you know. Oh, no. Good. Yeah. Right in the head. Damn it. More on that side. You check out these ones. See if there's anything on them that'll tell us who they were. Glasses and a hat? I don't think I remember. You know, I have these pair of glasses right now. And uh, these things, I've just had them for like two months and they're already breaking, the screws are coming loose. For a person like me that has to wear shit on my eyeballs to see better, a zombie apocalypse would be really shitty. Especially if you're running for your life, what if you drop your glasses? There's no going back. 
Wait a minute. Whoa, whoa, whoa. How does... Why is the bag there? What's happened? <coughs> Holy fuck, he's alive. <coughs> what happened to you? <coughs> you were in the woods with Krista. The woman I was with. What happened to her? Please. Oh, it's Tell the guy me. who stuck us up. Tell me. <coughs> Please. <laughs> That's right. That's right, Loco. Real N words never die, motherfucker. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, I think he got bit. I'm fine. I'm fine. Just, just lost my footing. Damn it. God oh, he's bit. Lurkers! I'm out of ammo. Come this way. Bitch. Damn it. Get your asses over here, both I'll of you. I'll cover you. We gotta get out of here. Get gotta help that here, guy. Get out of here. Get Come on. Come on, Clementine, hammer! Where's your hammer? Ah. Run, Nick. We have to go. Season two, Dickie. Almost, almost done with this. Oh, I got lots of. Next time on The Walking Dead. Ah, oh, it's already done. What are you gonna do? I finished 400 days. That's done. That's last cast, man. Someone came here looking for you. A man. What? Did he say what his name was? We know damn well who it was. Who is he? One of the guys we were with before. What's he gonna do? I can't keep going. I figure we got about four, five more days to reach those mountains. We ain't here to rob nobody. Just relax and put the gun down, man. I thought you were dead. Is it Ben? Maybe it's Ben. I just finished it today. It's still in the... <laughs> so let's see. <sighs> Looks like I went to with the majority this time. Me and 89.2% of players stopped to help Krista. 86% killed the dog. 69% gave water to that dude. 90% uh, accepted Nick's apology. And 51% went with Pete. Did you save Nick or Pete? So there we go. All that remains... And that's it. We just have to wait until the next episode. For the first episode, that's really good. I, I, I just want to keep playing. I wish the whole thing was already done. You know, maybe next season they should just release the game in full. Life is for the living. In the water. This is a very oh, Walking Dead song right here. I like the acoustic guitar. You feel and that you sing like run. this, and you talk well, about stuff that's emotional. In the water. And then the guitar is just oh, playing. Oh, oh, oh. So fucking Against the time, 
struggle skin wear it so I guess that does it for this cast here I have one more smaller game no I'm gonna keep going I have another game that'll be it's a surprise it's gonna be a surprise it's not a really long game or a really big game it's a smaller one it's another one that I just want to get out of the way and then I can get on to the bulk the bulk of the gaming that I have to do I got a bunch of good games I got a bunch of sh a buckload of Star Wars games and there's, uh, there's actually really good ones yeah, that I have he is never um, found. that I've played Shine back in the day keep your way that I will cast and then uh, I also have a Dark Souls I got some I got some good shit but there's one more little game I wanna get out of the way just burn skin through it wearing, skin wearing against the time struggle to keep our heads above the deep the hearts above the light. I joust off. Hey, I'm right here, brah. Plus, I still have a Final Fantasy VII playthrough to do. Mischief Makers is still there, too. I got my fingers in many pies. They'll all get, they'll all get a good finger fucking in. We'll finish it off eventually. His eyes are full of love. So yeah, I'd have to say with this episode, I like it. I like the way it starts off. I like this whole if this whole season we're playing is Clementine. Um, it's cool. I like I like the decision that they made because you can't just start off playing as a little girl, just kind of like in The Last of Us, because at one point you start playing as the girl that you're protecting and you pretty much everything. Uh, Everything that he taught her, she, she does. And uh, this is cool. Who knows? I wish they'd re release this stuff a bit quicker, but... So uh, this will conclude the broadcast of uh, Kubrick and the Walking Dead. Season 2. Episode 1. It was good. I'll be on... I'm just going to set up the next game. And I'll be on right away since I got it set up so this will be Kubrick signing out I'm not saying goodbye I'm just saying